You know, to see both uh, parties come together, you know, and try to talk about the issues, you know, because there's always going to be differences between the two sides. So they're coming together to try to, you know, understand those differences and how they can, you know, work on that. So I, I, I feel it's been really successful. Uh, I appreciate the summit because it's allowed me to make uh, many connections. Um, I found many resources and um, I've made um, some good connections. So I've got the network that I needed. So that's what I've uh, gotten out of the summit. Well, we've, we've been a co-sponsor of it now for two years and been involved with it for three years. Um, we've made a long-term commitment to developing the summit over the next several years. And we recognize the fact that any kind of undertaking like this that's as ambitious as the Africa Foundation USA is generally, not just re with regard to the summit, is not going to be something that's going to happen quickly. It's going to be something that has to be nurtured and fostered and brought along. I think that we're making uh, wonderful strides in terms of not only the quality of the programming that we're doing this year relative to past years, but also in terms of the, the type of people that we are attracting to come to the summit. Uh, we will learn our lessons from this year. Uh, we'll go back to the drawing boards, as they say, and we'll make it better again next year. So um, I'm satisfied with the progress. Uh, things can always be better, but what you do is you learn year by year, and everything is a matter of baby steps. It's a slow progress, and this will be a slow progress. Uh, my name is Moro Jafuni, and I'm originally from the Gambia, West Africa. And also, I am a member of the African Foundation USA, um, one of the um, uh, uh, programming committee for this uh, summit. This is the third summit in Cincinnati here. It started in um, 2010, uh, um, September. So we hope to keep it up all the time. That's why we have one coming up you know, this year for September too. Uh, so, so far with the conference today, I know it's not over yet, we still have some time. How do you feel like it's gone so far as far as the summit? It is going very well and it's very, very educated, you know, because um, what we really want to do with this African Foundation ESA is to unveil Africa to the United States because uh, uh, all other countries in the world know about Africa except the United States. Of course, they know the name and they know where the location is, but what is actually happening there, they don't know. And so being the case, uh, we really want Africa to have a connection with America when it comes to economic uh, basis, like business and stuff like that, because Africa is the next frontier. And uh, we just want to let Americans know that there's a lot that could be done in Africa, not only that the way they perceived us long, long time ago, you know, um, 
That's why we're here and trying to let the people know what Africa is all about and what's, what's out there and what we are ready to do with the rest of the world. Thank you.